Welcome to Apps and Law. I'm Brett Burney. Today's app is Graphio from Bulgarian based developer 10 Touch. Graphio is a universal app for both the iPhone and iPad, available for $7.99 and requires iOS 8.0 and higher. There is a free limited light version if you want to try it out before committing to the full featured app. Graphio recently received a major facelift in version 3. I've been recommending Graphio for years as one of the most enjoyable ways to create visual diagrams on the iPad for such things as flow charts, decision trees for a client, family trees to map relationships, corporate organizational charts, etc. Like most iOS apps, Graphio is straightforward to use, but it does require a small investment of time to make sure you're comfortable with the specific gestures and tools in the app. Graphio does an excellent job of introducing these tools in the onboarding process the first time you launch the app. The one page detailed help section is also handy and the pop-up tool tips can be toggled on and off. If you don't take the time to get familiar with gestures and tools, you will get frustrated while using the app. Thank goodness there is an undo button that I tapped frequently when I first started using Graphio. You can start a new diagram from scratch or there are a number of examples you can download for free to get you started. Whichever way you start, just start somewhere. You can always perfect it later. I like ensuring that shape recognition is turned on in the preferences so that when you roughly sketch a shape, Graphio will clean it up and make it all pretty. If you prefer not to draw, you can pull a shape, arrow, or pictogram from the included library. The free library contains most shapes that a legal professional will ever need, but for another $5.99 in-app purchase, you can get all of the additional libraries, or each library is also sold separately. To modify a shape, tap the select button and then change the color, outline, opacity, and shadow of a shape. Once you have two shapes, you can connect them by simply drawing a line between them. It can be a simple line, or you can add an arrow and change the thickness of the color, etc. Every shape can also hold text. Simply double tap inside a shape and start typing. Graphio comes with a variety of fonts, and you can pick the color and alignment. You can even add text on arrows. One feature I don't use often is the audio note. Just tap the microphone and talk away. This can certainly be useful if you're showing this as a presentation. The duplicate tool is useful for making additional identical boxes. The eyedropper tool is great for copying the format or style of one box or arrow to another. If you need to zoom or pan around your canvas, tap the hand icon to deactivate the drawing tools and move around. Lastly, Graphio offers excellent options for exporting your masterpiece. You can email the diagram as an image or PDF, save it to your camera roll or upload to Dropbox. There is a video presentation option, which sounds great, but it's only effective if you build the diagram in a perfect order. When I present from Graphio, I usually just mirror my iPad's screen and zoom in on the sections that I want my audience to see. Graphio will certainly give you an edge when presenting information that fits into a flowchart or a diagram. You can purchase Graphio from the link below and be sure to subscribe at appsandlaw.com for new app reviews. You can also subscribe to this YouTube channel. Thank you. Thank you.